Hello friends, in this video we will see checkbox for helper in MVC3 Razor. Now the HTML checkbox for helper renders a checkbox control on UI. This helper renders a control for models property and helps in model binding. Now let's see the application how it helps in model binding. Now we have a simple model that is just a class and we have a property that is this admin often we use on the forms. So it's, it's of type boolean and we are referencing this model that is using this model on a view and we have a simple view here which is rendered as index view so now we will be rendering a control for this is admin property and we want it to be a checkbox so let's see how we can do it I use HTML dot checkbox for now the first parameter it accepts is the expression that is the lambda expression so we say model is admin so I am creating the control or the editor for is admin property and that is using the checkbox for let's see what it renders now if I refresh the page it renders a checkbox now if you see the HTML it renders the is admin is admin the name of the property is used for setting the ID and the name attribute and you can see type checkbox is rendered now it has three overloads now let's see each one of them the second overload, overload is the object html attributes now using this overload you can set style attributes or any class or you can apply class to the control suppose I want to set its height and width so I can set its style passing the style it and you can see the checkbox is enlarged using these style properties or attributes now the third overload is the lambda expression and the i dictionary object now similarly you can create i dictionary object of the html attributes and you can pass multiple attributes using that dictionary object so this is how you can use checkbox for helper to render a checkbox for models property or property which is present in a class thank you friends